so what happened? Like, I was telling him that I needed to get stuff out of my backpack, and I was telling him that he was being rude or whatnot, and he fucking started elbowing me and stuff and trying to put his finger in my face and shit because he's mad or whatever. And then he started, like, being more aggressive, so, like, I had my selfie stick in my hand, like, trying to keep him from hitting me because he's, like, trying to come hit me. You're not gonna, you're not gonna hit me. I'm sorry. Has he hit you in the past? No, but, like, he just has these moments where he gets a little overly aggressive, and this is one of them. Like, I'm not gonna sit here and have you elbow with me and put your finger in my face and hug me. Like, and I'm just trying to get home to my kid. What do you live, Denver? In, in Las Vegas. Las Vegas? So, well, this is a connecting flight? Yeah, well, I just thought it was a straight through flight, too. Las Vegas. All I'm doing is trying to get home. Okay. So, I was, we're here for your safety, especially if there's gonna be yeah, like, we don't into. even have to sit next to each other. I don't even have to touch it. I bring him on my phone back, and that's it. So why, why did he have it? Because when all of that was going on, it had to fall it. <laughs> he picked it up? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, so how, 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 how did he open it? Like, he was elbowing me. Like, where, where at? Like, I'm sitting here, so he's elbowing me, trying to my side area and you know, on my arm. Was he using a lot of force? Yeah, it's like he wasn't just, like, he was trying to elbow me. So he was, he was, do you think he was doing, like, trying to cover up what he was doing uh, to the other people? Yeah, like, of course he ain't trying to make it seem like he's fighting in public, but it's still, like, why are you even being this aggressive with me? I'm just talking. Yeah, I mean, I, I elbowed her. Right? Yeah, yeah, and I'm like, did, and then he did it more than once, so I'm like, nigga, you're not finna fucking elbow me. And where were you saying he first hit you with the elbow at? Right here in my arm. And how did that feel? Did it cause you pain? No, it's just like the fact that he just did it and then he kept doing it. And then that's when I'm like, okay, you got me messed up. Okay. Well, how many times did he elbow you? Like two, three times. Okay. Where were the and other elbows? And then he started with the finger. And then it because I'm moving my arm, so it was here and on my arm. Did, did any of those cause you pain? Where you were like, ouch, that really hurt? Yeah, I'm like, dude, what are you doing? Okay. Do you just have a seat for me in, in the corner over here? Yeah. So, well, well, he seemed like he was ready to well, step on my foot because my what is he to you? He's my fiance, but Your fiance. Okay. Yeah. Just have a seat for me over there. Can we can we speak with the flight attendant? Sure. Looks like it's gonna be a domestic. So I just need to get Pretty the much. Uh, especially when they're hitting each other. That's domestic for sure. Yeah. So I want to talk to the flight and see what and they saw to cooperate. To help you a little bit better too. They were at the at E10. But they were calling for a corner. They were talking, she was sitting in the wheelchair, they were talking to and us and everything. So it could be either a heated thing for why they came over here. Mm -hmm. And then once once they started boarding and that's when the altercation started, but they were talking for Who witnessed the the fight between the passengers? I saw them going back. Can I talk to both of you guys? So it's, it's, it's going to be a domestic situation. Sure. So we just I just need to figure out what happened, what did you guys see. If I can talk to you guys one at a time to make sure. Oh, yes, you were first. Yes. He, he saw it first. Okay. So I, I was flagged down by some uh, passengers who looked alarmed, and then the passenger in front said they were hitting each other. And then when I approached and I saw them, they were hitting each other. I like the one. I like this. Okay, so, they, so yeah. you saw the physical contact, you saw yes. them, them pushing each other yes. back and forth. Yes. yes. Okay. Would you like to talk to a passenger that was close by? Yes, the passenger who, who reported it to you guys. Okay. I would like I to can, talk to them. It eventually got to where, like... And then, yeah, what, what, what did you see? So, when I was aware of the incident, I sat... They were, the incident was in six. I sat in eight. I was just sitting there. I was listening. He's cussing around. He's like, fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Oh. And then she said something to him. Yes. And he turned to her and pushed her right in her face. And like two, like two figures pushed her in her face, and I went up and I went, Miss, will you come with me? And then she's like, Yes, please. And so she picked up her stuff, and then he had one of her bags like wrapped around his leg, and he would let her have it. And I was like, Can you like go over her bag? And he was like, That's my fucking wife. And she went, We're not married. Then I went, Please just come with me. And she's like, Thank you. But he pushed her right in her so face. So you saw that physical guy. You saw. Like grabbed her in her he face. He smushed her in her face. Now they, they would his hand stay on her face a little bit or he like shove her face. It was for like it was more than just like a one second thing. Like she remember what hand he uses right or left? He reached over, so, so kind of his left. 
Okay. And he then, was on the window. And then, so you guys, you two saw the... the they were right in front of them, and then I heard them, they started to argue and like really fight. And then um, he started to... Uh, it sounded like he was starting to threaten her, and then she was like, don't touch me, and she was like, I'll get you back. But then um, it looked like we were trying to not want to escalate anything, but it looked like he started to get bruised, and like shove her in. And she kind of started getting back. So I was like, I'm going to get you back. I'm going to tell the police, like, you know, you're going to see But then she, I saw like a cane. A cane? Yeah, it looked like a metal cane. Uh, but I think she was the one with the metal cane. Okay. But that's she all it's like so, but she was in the Yeah, she has a foot injury. Yeah. So, um, when you say hitting, was it close fist, open fist, elbows, or? I, I wasn't able to see that well. Yeah. I just saw like hands, like moving. Yeah. Okay. Do so you have your ID on you? Um, I, I know the flight's going to take off, so I'm not going to have you work for uh, with, uh, statement because I don't think we have that time oh, but if, if we can get your ID and a phone number to contact you later because we're going to have to go handle this but it doesn't look like it's a bit messy now. She's my girlfriend so maybe it makes sense just to pick yeah. 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 it I'll just, I'll just take your name and your phone number if you have to go back on a plane. Yeah. Yeah. I know like you have your ID on you? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. So here is where we're at, okay? We have a few witnesses, okay? They saw a cane being used. That is fun. They, they saw... Like, now, did you, did you use that to hit him with? What, yeah, because he was like... So you hit him with the, the like, cane? I just was swinging it to keep him from hitting me. Well, when, when you were swinging, did you hit him at all with it? Did know. you make contact with him? I don't know. Okay. So, just start from the beginning. What... What caused this fight? We were sitting down in our seat. and Already on the plane? Yeah. We Did you guys have any altercation out here? Or were you guys no, good up we here? No, we were good up here. Like, we just got on the plane and everything just went left. Because his back, I had got in first. He was like, I'm not going to sit in the middle seat. So I had to come out and then get back in. And my foot's hurt. Or whatever, because I sprung it on our trip. And so... He had left his bag under the seat or whatever. And I'm like, dude, your bag is too big. I need to switch it. He's like, forget it. Don't do it right now. Whatever. And as I'm like talking to him, like, I was like, well, I need to get something out of my bag. And I'm reaching over to get my bag. He's talking about you doing too much and all this kind of stuff. And then like one thing led to another. And he started like elbowing me and trying to put his finger in my face. And when he kept elbowing me, like, and when he come at me, I just... He was like, you're not finna hit me. You're not finna touch me. So now, I know we talked about the elbowing earlier. So when he he struck you with the elbow on your side, mm -hmm. from we'll do a pain scale of zero to five. Zero being you felt no pain to five being. I don't know. It, I didn't feel anything because my adrenaline was rushing. How do you feel right now? Right now, I'm just scared that I'm finna miss this flight and I ain't gonna be able to get home to my kids. Okay, but uh, but more of the pain. Like, do you feel it yeah, right now? My pain, my pain is only in my foot. Like okay. from it being strong. So, so the elbow didn't cause. No, like it didn't cause any like major anything. Okay. No. So so he started elbowing you. What did you do? I started trying to defend myself. At one point, I told him I was like, I will punch you in the face. You're not gonna, you know. And then that's when the fingers and you know him coming at me and stuff, like and still trying to elbow me and shit. Like I was just. So wh where did the cane come from? I had it in my hand because I was going to get ready to watch TV. I it was already set up. He even broke it and everything. I had it set up because I was going to. I was talking to my kids mm -hmm. on it and my uh, sister-in-law about my brother having my car and how he was going to get from the airport and all that kind of stuff. It was really so. Yeah, I know you said you were swinging the cane. You just don't remember if you made contact with them no. or anything. No. Now, is that a cane or is that? No, a... it's not a cane. It's a selfie, selfie stick. Selfie stick. He okay. Tore, he broke like, it. the passengers thought it was a cane. Yeah, no. So he he did break it though. Yes, he broke it sitting right there and okay. put it in the damn back of his seat. Okay. Now, did you do you re, do you remember hitting him at all? Not before he was physical with me. But so afterwards. Yeah. Like, you remember like how how did you did was it pushing the punching slapping? Yeah, it was me pushing him back. Like, no, you're not gonna hit me. You know, like, I told him I would punch him, but I ain't gonna so punch him. You know what I mean? Like, okay. 
So at what point did you decide to use physical force against them? Like when after he, he elbowed you when, when he after he elbowed when you? He was coming at me like he was finna hit me. Okay. So I just automatically like, So so he already had it. elbowed you, correct? Yes. And then he was coming back at you. Yes. And that's when you try to defend yes. yourself. Yes. Gotcha. Alright. Um just start from the beginning. What what happened? <laughs> Man, so I was asleep. I don't even really, I don't know she kept asking for the bag. Okay. Get my bag, get my bag, get my bag. I'm like, baby, I got, I'll give you a bag in a second. And then she's like, give me my bag, give me my bag. Because, you know, we had to switch seats. I don't even know what she wanted out of bag. I'm like, just wait. Now, damn, wait. Just let me get situated. Wait. I'll get you the bag. What's in the bag? Just wait. You know, your, your leg already messed up. I've been taking care of from all day, every day. From the day one, like, hey, I get this for you. Sit down, relax, don't do nothing, move, just sit down. I got you, I'll bring you food, I get you, right, whatever you want. Okay. But I was asleep, she sleep, she tell me about the bag or something. She Is mad. this already on the plane? Yeah, we just got on the plane. She was asking, kept asking. And, for and so you fell asleep immediately when you got on. No, nah, I was. I, I really wasn't even up yet getting on the plane. So okay. yeah, when I got back on the plane, I was like, okay, like, man, I'm going to sleep. And she's like, give, I'm like, she's like, you know, I'm like, back in my bed. I'm like, babe, goddamn, damn, wait, shit, just give me a goddamn second. I get the goddamn bag. You know, you wake somebody up, they be cranky. You know. No, I got you. Yeah. yeah. And she was reaching over. I'm like, just wait. God damn. Because my bag don't fit under her like that. So I'm like, hold on. I got to get your bag. I'm going to get the bag. Just give me a second. We literally just got on the plane. See, I'm not even woke yet. Okay. I'm up, but I'm not up. You know what I mean? Like, I'm still drowned. I'm still. Shit, I'm ready to go right back to sleep. Fuck that bag. We got an hour and 40 minute flight till we get home. Okay. Then she gets mad at me because I'm not moving fast enough for her to give her. I don't even know what she wanted in the bag. I can't even remember. The okay. selfie stick or the the thing we put on the seat for. I don't even remember what she was asking for in the bag. I really didn't care. Okay. To be honest with you, because I was tired. She kept leaning over me trying to get. I'm like, no, just wait. So she was adamant about getting. Moving yeah, back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moving the back. Okay. I'm like, this way, leaning off. I'm like, this way, wait. I'll get the bag. Give me a second. Okay. And she gets mad at me because she's trying to get the bag and I'm telling her just to wait a second. I'm gonna switch the bag. Let the people let we just getting on the plane. Let's get situated first. And I get you the bag and uh, earbuds or whatever they was and I don't even remember. Okay. She, I'm still asleep now. I'm asleep right now. So so we don't what, have no altercations for real. The same. What what happened after that? Shit, I don't really remember. Okay, shit. Let me, let me, uh, this is what I got. I'm gonna be straight up with you, okay? I, I have I have witnesses, and I have what she's telling me, okay? You broke her selfie stick. No, I broke the selfie stick. Okay. I like I hit three times with it. What? Like she trying to do like this. Trying well, to get no, because she said, okay, I got witnesses saying that you put your hands on her. Not necessarily your hands that you were you were assaulting her. Okay. No, what I was doing. Look, you just need to be honest, okay? No, I'm being honest okay. with you. Okay, because initially you told me that you don't remember. Okay, that's why. No, just, I want you to I be don't straight. Remember, this is just straight up. When she kept trying to reach for the bag, I'm like, just wait. Your leg is already messed up. You can't even move it. This is what I'm telling her. She's been extra aggressive trying to get the bag. I'm like, will you stop and just wait? Will you quit? This is what I'm telling her. Bring her ass over. I tell her she know what I'm doing. It's on camera. I'm gonna lie. I'm 43 years old. I lie about nothing. I'm getting her off of me from trying to get the bag. Nobody seeing her do that. <laughs> Nobody seeing her literally reach over me trying to okay. grab the bag, and I'm like, so no, that, 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 that's wait. what we're trying to figure out. But yes, okay, that's what so it is. why wh why did you elbow her multiple times? I got hit with the stick when she okay. was trying to get the bag. She's like, give me my, I'm like, man, get this goddamn stick off me. And I broke it. So I didn't break it when she hit me. I already had it in my hand. So we, I broke the stick because I got mad. So she, she was trying to hit you with the stick? Yeah. And that was so I got before mad. you you had an elbow affair? It wasn't no elbows. I get off of me. 
because she kept trying to lean over me like this and get the bag. What you going to do? Sit down right here. Okay. Bag under the seat. She's leaning over. I'm like, babe, will you wait? Wait a second. That's what they might have been seeing. They're not seeing her. The bag is under the seat. She gave me my bag. I need to get it out. Hey, wait. I'll get the goddamn selfie out there. Whatever it was. Did you want an earbud or something? That's when I was like, move. I wasn't just like, Okay. I'm like, no, stop. I'll get the bag. Okay. And so we have... We have a witness saying you, you also grabbed her by her mouth and pushed her away from you. So what was that what about? If somebody is on you, what you supposed to do? Okay, so what you're trying to say is she was the aggressor in this. She was trying to get the bag. She was getting on top of you. You were just trying to get her off of you. Yeah, I wanna, I'm sitting down. Okay. I'm not doing nothing. I'm literally sitting down. I'm not okay. arguing. Did, did you make any comments to Senate her about so anything? Five, like, did you threaten her in any way or shape or form? Your flight is currently on the ground, making like, its way over leave to Leave me alone. We will begin deep Okay, but you didn't say like you would do something craft. to her if she didn't we'll leave you alone or. or no, nah, just okay. regular, no, nah, nothing, man. you know, like, right. you know, just. Like, like, uh, like I said, we have witnesses saying that you made threats to her, okay? This is where I, so, uh, I, I, after she, you, you broke the selfie stick and she, she stopped, what, what caused her to stop? Everybody. Like, like the, like the flight just, crew like, and everything? No, we just, I just, just stopped, nobody came over and said, Get him and stop. And I'm like, so she just stopped out of out yeah. Of I just I, I broke it. like we already we you know we've been together thirteen years. Okay. Like stop. Have you ever had any uh, running with the law for domestic violence or anything like yeah, that? No. No. Okay. No. We so don't have none of that. I'm not gonna get no domestic violence no case. I ain't doing that with no no sir. Okay. So I, so no after everything violence. stopped, what happened after that? They moved. It. They move and they they kick you guys off the flight. Yeah. Okay. But after we fight, we still were sitting there. We were so. I just gonna leave me alone. Shut up talking to me. Yeah, you shut up talking to me. So what's what's the plan for tonight? You guys aren't getting on this flight. It, it's gone. It's left. Probably don't have a flight until tomorrow. What's the plan? Oh my god. I don't even know, man. We've been on the plane already enough. I don't even know. All right. Just hang out with me. We'll just have to talk. So, I'm just trying to get all the, the facts straight in the case. Like I said, it's hard for us to piece it together when we weren't there to witness it. We got people telling us one thing. We had two different stories here, okay? So, before you even touched them, were you were you trying to lean over them to grab your bag or anything like that? I was getting something out of my bag, but it wasn't like in any type of aggressive manner or anything. Do you think he that's what, what caused me, the... No, he started telling me like, you're doing too much and you're ungrateful and all this other kind of shit. And I'm like, fine, I, ain't gotta, I don't ever got to fucking travel with you ever again. And then he went to call me a bitch and saying how ungrateful I was. And just all of that extra shit. And then he just... <laughs> now, did he make any threats to you? Yeah. Right. Well, we have... I have witnesses saying he threatened you. He did. He said, before well, we get off this plane, I'm going to get you shit for hitting me with that. Okay. Hey, have you guys had any other domestic violence cases Wait, in the past? Not cases, no. But we've gotten into it before. But never where cops were involved? No. Okay. I know. Um, how are you feeling right now? Do you feel any pain? Like no, other than my sprain. But that's that's, that's yeah, that's, that's just it. That's not, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna take him for. What? What? Class C? Yeah, it's gonna be class C, but I mean, there's definitely a further in spot. So. Yeah. All right, go ahead and stand up for me. Let's face my partner over here. It's fun, bud. I appreciate it. I'm going to jail, though. In Texas, so I don't even know where the hell I'm at. Yeah, before I get one cut, you back about it. Where I got to go. So what's going to happen is you get transported to our jail. It's the DFW airport for jail. For what? Hmm? For what? So right now it's uh, assault, family violence. Assault? Family violence, yes, sir. I'm and the so, one got hit with the stick. Just based on, I, I'm not the one. So based off his investigation, the witnesses. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. 
I have uh, wait, wait, wait. Who got hit with the stick? Me or her? Okay. According That's to witnesses, what I want to know. You're the only one saying that you got hit with the stick, okay? She said she didn't she didn't hit you with but that's besides the fact, okay. I got witnesses saying you you assaulted her and you threatened and you threatened her. Okay. But right now is you appear to be the aggressor and every everybody I talked with, you're the aggressor at this point. Okay. You're gonna be going to jail. Right now it's a class C family violence. I just can't leave you here though. With her, because things no, don't we don't want things that could get even more out of control. I don't even okay? got nowhere to go. Okay. How the fuck you gonna try to send me okay, to jail on. and fucking come check? On. Let's go. And I ain't got nowhere to go. You don't gotta get aggressive. You let me talk. This is my motherfucking wife, thirteen okay. years, man. Well, at this don't point, do that, man. I ain't even got I, no phone call. I, I, I ain't got no money. I ain't got no nothing okay, on when me. You, when you get to jail. I, where, need to, where, I don't where, even know no numbers. My phone dead. Everything. You got to at least let me talk to her, man. I ain't. Where, where, you you right here with us. Where's your phone? It's in my bag. I'm just saying, you right here with okay, us. right now, she, she's scared of me, okay? It's a five times and 18 rob y'all to my, she's scared of me. We'll get What's everything up? figured out, okay? I'll get, to, I'll, I'll, I'll ask her if there's any phone numbers that you need. I'll write them down. I'll take my phone and get to jail. That's crazy, bro. I gotta go to jail. Man. I'm the one getting hit. I ain't no cameras on the plane. Just answer that for me. Is there cameras on the plane? No, there's no cameras on the plane. So only the fact that I can hit and she don't she don't get hit. She hit me and she don't go to jail. So we just need my lawyer. I don't know what the fuck I'm going to jail for. And I don't know why I get hit with a fucking selfie stick and shit. Just because I don't want to give it a bag right away. That's crazy. Like I'm just abusing this lady on the plane. So like I said, so from start to finish, from all, with the witnesses I talked to, they kind of corroborated what you were saying. He was the aggressor. I know every, you were in a heated moment, you probably don't remember exactly what happened. That happened? We got another disturbance coming into the exact same gate that you're at. And like, um, I know he, he, from what they were saying, he hit you. He hit you on the on the face. Well, pushed you on the face. So it seems like he's the aggressor. So he's going to jail because I cannot in good way, especially after you told me that he said he was going to punch you in the face before for you hitting him with the stick. I, I can't in good conscience just leave him out with you. I can't leave you guys go together and then something else happens. Okay, that's why he's going to jail for family violence. Um, it's going to be upgraded to class A misdemeanor because he threatened you. Um, I, I don't know the, he's saying you hit him with the selfie stick. I know you saying you were using a self-defense and you don't know if you hit him or not. The witnesses didn't see you hitting him with it or anything. But I, I mean, at this point, that's why we did what we did. We have to do something, especially if, I, I really believe if I, if I would have let, just let you guys go, it would have escalated even further tonight, okay? Um, this is what we call a family, family violence packet, okay? All you gotta do is just, Bill, I'll, 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 I'll kind of walk you through it. So you said he's your fiance. fiance. Uh, has a suspect? Uh, has he ever hurt you before? You said no. There's a. Well, I know you said so. There's been some. But yeah, we. But there's like arguing, but never physical. Yeah, no, like, this is yeah. the first time it's ever got to that point. No, like we've gotten a little physical, like you know, but not to the point where I felt like I was unsafe or. Okay. Like, I couldn't handle myself, you know what I mean? Like, if I gotta go to jail, she gotta go to jail. She the one started it. I know, goddamn. Violent clowns and no shit like this, here, man. Motherfucker ain't getting to a family altercation. You gotta go to jail. That's that, nah, man. Hey, y'all, y'all laws are stay away behind in time, man. I might go to jail for no goddamn family altercations, man. Who does that anymore? Nobody takes you to jail for family altercations no more.